Our top story here at 6 o'clock, archaeologists discovered 17 unmarked burials at Oakland Cemetery in their search for possible victims of the 1921 Tulsa Race Massacre. Thanks for joining us. I'm Craig Day. And I'm Lori Fulbright. Archaeologists are not calling this a mass grave. News on 6's Amy Slanchik is live with an update on their investigation. Amy? Lori and Craig, at the beginning of this latest excavation, archaeologists said they wanted to search to the west and to the south of where they were last summer. Now they're finding burials in both of those areas. The city of Tulsa waited until today to reveal archaeologists found a total of 17 burials over the weekend. State archaeologist Dr. Carrie Stackelbeck says they were found in two different areas. She says 12 adult burials were found to the west of where Reuben Everett and Eddie Lockhart's headstones are located. Those are two known massacre victims, but archaeologists have always said they aren't sure if the two are in fact buried there. Scientists also revisited the area where they say one man with multiple gunshot wounds was found last summer and started to expand their search south of that. On Saturday, that effort proved to be profitable to the team. Within that trench, we've now exposed um, an additional five graves of um, that are adult size as well. The team from Stantec Incorporated, formerly known as Cardno, is back to help with the investigation. From the fence at the cemetery, they could be seen sifting with their equipment today. From the air, Osage Sky News 6 shows several archaeologists in the pit that is west of Reuben and Eddie's headstones. Stackelbeck says going forward, a lot of work will be done by hand. To clean up those coffins um, and so that we can get a better sense of each one of those graves um, in order to get a sense of the um, construction style, the shape, um, whether or not there's any kind of hardware that's present. And that work done by hand will help scientists determine which burials to remove and which they might leave in place. Live in Tulsa, Amy Slanchik, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.